assalamu alaikum great sex today we are doing chapter number seven number patterns it's a practice now one page number 163 open your book page number 163 you will find out the question uh, given that the nth term tn of a sequence is tn is equal to 4n plus 7 find the fourth term you, they are giving you basically a rule and they are asking to find out the fourth term. They, they, this question has basically a two part. The second part is the sum of the fourth term and the seventh term. So first of all, you have to find out the fourth term. What is the fourth uh, term and what is the sequence? They are asking T4. In this uh, sequence, they are giving you the sequence. They are giving you an, a pattern. Tn is equal to 4n. What is the value of n here? is the fourth so you will write wherever we have a n you will write the four so you will write four times four because it's they are saying four n so you will write four times four plus seven four four is a sixteen you will write sixteen plus seven you will get the answer twenty three now let's see uh, the, the second part in the second part they are asking the sum of fourth term the fourth term is already here what will the seventh term you have first of all you have to find out the seventh term then you have to find out the sum so what is the seventh term? So you will write the value of n is here is seven. So you will write t seven is equal to four times seven plus seven is equal to twenty eight plus seven. Uh, it will be thirty five. And now they are asking the sum of fourth term and the seventh term. You will add both values. You will get twenty three and thirty five. The answer will be fifty eight. Now class, we are doing the practice now three which is on the page number 164 please check it out uh, in this again we have a two question but they have a four part in the question number one and three part in the question number two uh, first of all we will solve the question number one what is this find a formula of a general term you have to find out the formula at this time in the practice now too you, you they are already giving you the formula so in this one you have to find out uh, the formula First of all, you have to create the general term. They are asking, general term means if they are asking for you have to uh, find uh, the 99th value. What is the 99th value in this uh, equation? So you, that is, that uh, you cannot uh, create each and everything for, you can find out by using that formula directly the 99th value. So first of all, what we will solve? Uh, for In the first question, they are saying the 5, 9, 13, 17 and 21 since the common difference is basically a 4 so what will be the formula tn is equal to 4n what will be the plus term you will write the first term before the t1 is you have to count t0 what it will be 5 minus 4 it will be the 1 so you will write the general term of a sequence tn is equal to 4n plus 1 so what will be the formula for the b1 in the b1 they are saying 7 12 17 22 and 27 so you can find out the difference between this is 5 so we'll, we are writing the 5 and what will the formula tn is equal to 5n plus what what value will you will give you the value the term before t1 is count the t0 so you will write the t0 what it will be uh, the difference is 5 so you will write 5 7 minus 2 because the first value is 7 so you are writing the 7 and what is the uh, for 5 fifth value you will write a uh, uh, first value is will uh, minus it so you will get the value 2 so what will the general term sequence will be 5n plus 2 if they are asking to find out the second value so you will write uh, n value is second 15 5 plus 2 or uh, 5 times 2 you will get 10 10 plus 2 you will get 12 check it out they are giving you the 12 value now we are doing the c part in the c part they are saying that 2 4 uh, a 14 20 and 26 you can find out the particular difference there is a difference between them is 6 so you will write tn is equal to 6 n plus what what will be the first value how if we are doing the same process they are doing t1 is count t0 what will be 2 minus 6 look at this they are not adding it they were subtracting the 4 so general term of the sequence is tn is equal to 6 and minus 4 what is the equation now since it is a 1 4 7 10 and you can see that is a difference between is 3 so you will write the common difference is 
3 the tn will be 3n plus what value the term before t1 is c with the counter value is t0 so what you will write first value is 1 so you will write the 1 what is the difference minus 3 so you will write the minus 3 okay and you will get 1 minus a you will get minus 2 so you will write tn is equal to 3n minus 2 now we will do the question number 2 consider the sequence 3 7 11 19 what you have to do write the next two terms of a sequence first of all then you have to find out the term of n formula for the n term of the sequence in the third hence uh, the find the fifth eighth term so what is the difference you can uh, notice it 3 and 7 it will be the difference of a 4 7 11 there is a difference of a 4 so what will be the next two term it will be the 23 and 27 so 19 plus 4 you will get 23 23 plus 4 you will get 27 so what is the uh, term n formula you will write the since uh, last uh, in the question number one we already explained it how to calculate you how to find out the general term formula since the common difference is 4 and the tn is equal to 4n what is will be the next the term before t1 is a uh, counter t0 so you will write 3 minus 4 so you will get minus 1 so the general term for sequence will be uh, 4n minus 1 here we already now find out the sequence what is the sequence now now we can easily find out the 50th value in the 50th value and the value of n is 50 so you will write t 50 is equal to 4 times 50 minus 1 4 times 50 you will get 200 200 minus 1 you will get 199 okay your home task is you have to do question number 1, 2 and 3 of uh, uh, exercise uh, 7b. Okay class, this is the end of today's lecture. Have a nice day. Allah Hafiz.